Hey guys, Retro here with yet another unboxing. But this time we have something just a little bit different, as in fact I do have a puzzle which I need to uncode. So thanks to the guys at Rebellion, as you can see on my t-shirt, which I did get in this, they have sent me something for the brand new upcoming game of Sniper Elite 5. So first off, they sent me this massive bag. Which honestly is probably, if it focuses, is probably great for those outings. Now, the bag itself has tons of compartments, but I have removed a lot of the items already. Makes it easier for the video, and well, you'll understand in a little bit of time. So first off inside is this box. Now, it is branded. It's quite heavy, and... I don't know if you guys can hear that. It is metal, and on this side is a bit of a padlock. Now, I did the stupid thing of thinking that one of the items inside was in fact the reason to unlock in the code. I may have spent an hour googling how to use a compass, because apparently my Duke of Edinburgh training was not enough. Turns out, I'm about to show you that compass, but uh, yeah, it has nothing to do with the padlock. So first off, we received this mission briefing, and inside was a little bit of information on what exactly we need to do. As you can see, it explains our top secret briefing. So it looks like we've got two objectives, one being how to crack the code on the padlock, and the other to actually find the officer target. Now, I'll get onto the target a little bit later on, but if you want to play along, I will leave the answers in the description below, so don't click see more till later. Moving on, we also received these maps. Now, I think these are actually maps which are very similar to the ones in the game. But as you can see, we've got, ah, we've got the Atlantic Wall. That is actually the first mission that you play. So yeah, these will be really good for the gameplay. Now, within the bag itself, we have received a few items. First off is obviously your trusty hip flask. Second is we got some nice little neat dog tags and we'll get onto this number in a little bit and then we also have something in this box now this is basically the compass and yes i spent forever trying to work it out turns out it's not related to the padlock but it's really neat so if anyone does go walk in definitely get yourself one of these and they are quite professional also within the bag we also received this notebook and of course, it's mainly in case you want to jot any of your findings down. Or, you know, for those trusty up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, BA start cheat code. On to the numbers. So if you look at the back of the flask and the back of the dog tags, these actually have some circled numbers. Turns out these are actually exactly what you need for the padlock itself. Now, I managed to find, uh, I think, three out of the four, which was the four on the back of the notepad, four on the back of the hip flask, and then one on the back of the dog tag. Uh, I couldn't find the fourth number, but I managed to guess it, and the answer ended up being 1044. Oh, and one last thing I forgot to mention is that we also got this smaller bag, which had some other things in as well, which is really actually pretty cute. Oh, there's a pen. I found my pen. <laughs> and uh yeah i think see this is the thing there's so many pockets i literally keep finding things every time i open this now on to the ammo crate itself so let's get it unlocked i may have done this earlier so that i can't oh maybe i can't get the padlock off one second so inside it's really cool we've got our own little lunch box which if i can position this right has the Sniper Elite branding with some stuff inside we'll get onto in a second. And also our secret files. Now remember I mentioned our second objective, so I'm going to do a little slow-mo of it panning across these so that you can give them a read yourself and hopefully guess who our target is. As mentioned, if you want the answers, I will put them in the description, but make sure not to look until you've figured it out. Within the lunchbox, we actually have, if I can give it an open, somehow, there we go, oh, there we go, we have our little rations. So this is actually the answers, so I won't open those on, on camera, but we also have, not only do we have a chocolate bar, whoever's idea this was, thank you very much, you have no idea how much I love chocolate, but also there's this really cute little keyring, which is actually a bullet. I've heard it might actually be a sort of like a can opener, bottle opener, but I'm not 100% sure. But yeah, 
That's pretty neat. Giant thank you to Rebellion for sending this over. And don't forget to like and subscribe as I have plenty of Sniper Elite videos dropping. Or check out my socials or Twitch stream for further gameplay. And I'll see you guys later.